All right, we're here in the hallways of West Jessamine High School where Coach Damon Kelly and his West Jessamine Colts just beat Casey County pretty handily. Uh, Coach, talk to me first of all about the game tonight. Well, I thought we, did, we came out and we took care of business. Uh, you know, kids played hard. It's tough playing three games and three nights. Uh, you know, but it's good to be back in our gym and, and in front of our home crowd. And the kids, you always worry they're going to come out dead legged. But, you know, we came out and we, we got after them early. We kept our pressure on. And, and I was pleased to get out with a, with a good win tonight. Talk to me about some of the guys that uh, has been stepping up over the, the course of the season so far, Coach, for you. Well, we, we have got four guys coming back that started for us last year. And, and they bring a lot of leadership and experience to us. Chase Fane and Robbie Argan are both seniors. Uh, Chase is having an excellent season, averaging about 18.5 points and eight rebounds a game. Robbie's just a warrior. He just goes to battle. Uh, every time he's out on the floor, you have to give him breathers, you know, pretty frequently because he just gives everything he's got out there. And then two juniors that started last year and big players as force as well. Will Henderson's a, a three-year starter at the point. Uh, Dalton Peters is a big-time scorer for us. And, uh, you know, that's nice to have that experience coming back from last year. We've had some, some younger guys step up as well to give us some depth. Uh, Tanner Richards really did a nice job for us as a, as a defender and a role player for us out there so uh, you know it's been a team effort we don't have one guy that, that comes out and scores 25 and 9 we've got four or five guys capable of having the next guys. you guys uh, certainly play as a team out there defense was the the case of this game tonight against Casey County and uh, you know of course that triggered your offense coach yeah we I, I'm a big believer that if you don't defend you're not going to win basketball games and, and these guys have bought into that I think uh, you know, it's, you, you've got to be able to shut people down because no matter how talented you are offensively, when you run up against a team, another team that plays good defense, you got to be able to shut them down because it's going to be a lower scoring possession by possession game. You're looking for that signature win. I heard you talking a little bit there to your to your team, and you got the opportunity on Tuesday night, Madison Central, your next opponent coach. Well, that's going to be a, a major challenge for us, I and mean, they're loaded. Uh, yeah. A lot of experience back. They've got, they've got a senior Latin team. They've got Division One athletes at so three or four positions. You know, we're we're excited about the opportunity to play them. I, I hope I'm still excited that we got to play them after the game because I know it's going to be a, a challenge for us to, to stay in the ball game. You got a lot of hype surrounding your team right now. A, a lot of talk about you guys. Uh, are, are one of the favorites actually right now to come out of the region 12 and uh, how does that make you feel? Well, I mean, I, I think we've got a chance. I think we're in the mix. Pulaski County's playing off of their basketball right now. Southwestern has a, a ton of experience back from a regional winner. They know what it takes to do it. Wayne County's had a very good season. Uh, Somerset, East Jessamine, Boyle County, Lincoln County, you know, there, there's a lot of competition. We're in the mix and and we've got a chance if we play well. But right now, we're just focused on getting better each day. It's uh, the postseason will be here before we know it, but it's not time yet to be, uh, you know, putting all our focus on that. All right, coach. I appreciate your time. Good win tonight. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right.